for Dave Lynch again on the Gretchen Motor Sports Bar Films. He's got a very eventful 2011 season, and here he is out of the race car. I'll tell you what, it's looking like a pretty race car, and I'm down here with a very happy driver, Chris Wimmer. Congratulations, buddy. You swept the Reem World Crown 300. Congratulations, buddy. Awesome, awesome effort. I'm speechless, and I'm the announcer. Congratulations, man. Thank you very much. Me too. I, uh, I couldn't believe it. I mean, the car was perfect from, uh, from the first lap, and uh, it was just awesome. The guys did an excellent job in the pitch. We didn't change anything. Uh, got a four tires at that break, and uh, when I saw those guys come in, I got uh, 40 to go there, but I was sitting down. But, uh, the car was so good that I just I drove it as hard as I could. You guys were the definition of under the radar this week. You really weren't top of the charts. You were good, but you didn't have a whole lot of people talking about you down there, other than a pretty good car in the 52. But man, you guys showed up today on fire. What was different about today? I'm not sure. Yeah, we battled when we got here. Just uh, battled tight, 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 tight. And uh, on Saturday, we tried a couple things, and we just hit on something. Uh, and uh, just left it, and it worked. You had a good view of the racetrack. Not a whole lot happened in the front of you. Some of the guys raced your hard. I know Eddie Hoffman did a wonderful job at the end of that second segment to stay alive. They raced your hard. They raced you clean. But other than that, you guys had a pretty good day. Were the spotters telling you about everything going on behind you? Uh, yeah, she was. Uh, my mom spots me, but she was. Uh, she just let me drive forward, and uh, she was letting me know what was going on behind me. Did the racetrack change on you guys today from start to finish? Uh, not really. I got a little tight on that second set of tires, but. Uh, Seemed like when we would have uh, restarts and it cool down, uh, it, it would come in and just get tired of walking right around. Okay, you're the inaugural winner of the new format here of the World Crown 300. And we've got the Reem folks on board, all new. Your thoughts on the format now that it's all over? I, I think it's a neat deal. It was, uh, I was a little worried there with the 25 to go. I wanted to put tires on, but, but when you're leading, it's kind of hard to do. But I thought it was a neat deal. Uh, <coughs> it was neat to, to have the invert and everything. Who would you like to thank on the race car here today? I'd really like to thank Kriegel. They, uh, they helped me out. They make a spray gun that you can get in a local uh, hardware store. And I'd really like to thank all the guys here. i got guys that I normally don't work with because everybody had to work this week. So I want to thank all them guys, my parents, my brother. Everybody. Okay, it's a beautiful trophy. You get to wear the crown, but there's $20,000 down in the infield with your name on it. Can I borrow 10 grand? <laughs> I'm sure my dad's probably already got it. <laughs> Outstanding, everybody. How about a big hand for Chris Wimmer? <laughs>